How does 3D printing change if you don't need support structures and don't even need a build surface underneath the part? Pete Zielinski, Additive Manufacturing Media. I'm at Rapid TCT in Detroit, Michigan. Rapid liquid printing, 3D prints silicon using this water-based gel to support the part as it's made. The ingredients of the silicon come together in these separate streams just before deposition into the gel. This method of 3D printing is a means, for example, of making gaskets and seals. A gasket like this one might have needed support structures, would have needed to be made in multiple pieces that were joined together. Another possibility, complex lattice forms like this one, which varies in stiffness and hardness through material change through the course of the build combined with lattice density change through the course of the build. One implication of 3D printing without a build surface, without support structures, is 3D printed layers do not have to be flat, parallel, horizontal. The deposition can follow complex paths that, that weave up and down and Z. So gravity-free 3D printing is, among other things, a software solution. Uh, special software for this process enables faster, more efficient builds taking advantage of complex deposition paths.